You're watching ABC News coming to you live from Floriade. Where the sun has set and the first evening of Nightfest is underway, Floriard After Hours runs until Sunday. And as well as plenty of illumination about the place, there'll be concerts, a dance party and even some comedy. Floriard depends hugely on the efforts of volunteers. They're selfless Canberrans who have given willingly of their time and energy to make this a reality. I spoke with one of them a little earlier. Colleen Stock is a volunteer. You've been here for 10 years. What is it about Floriard for you? For me, Floriard is the greatest event that Canberra's got to offer and who wouldn't want to be part of it? 10 years ago, what made you start volunteering? Um, just the community spirit and it's great to have an opportunity to join in and do that sort of thing. The community spirit you see, you feel that everywhere you wander around, don't you? You do, absolutely, yes. Is it that that's kept you coming back year after year for the last decade? Yes, it has, and every year it's different. The gardens have got a different setup, and the people are some of them are the old friends and some are new friends. Yeah. A, a good chance to make friends. Uh, we've seen incredible growth over the years, where so many people come to Florio from not just Australia or Canberra, but right around the globe. I wonder why do you think that that's happened? Um, I think it's been more widely publicised than it has in the past and people talk and people love to come and smell the flowers. Well, and on that note, what would you say to anyone who hasn't been down to smell the flowers? Hurry up, get here, we need you. <laughs> <laughs> well, that sounds pretty clear to me. Thanks so much for your volunteering and thanks for joining us this evening. Thank you, Dan.